What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video and today we are going to find out just how effective the new Super Saiyan 4 Broly is on Super Battle Road. More specifically the pure Saiyan stage of Super Battle Road without his main support, his main linking partner, Super Saiyan 4 Vegito. Now as you guys can see, this team is pretty solid so I'm not too worried about our ability to obviously beat the event but if my memory serves me correctly this stage absolutely kicked my ass back in the day i'm pretty sure it's still the hardest category super battle road stage on global at least so we might be a little bit more cautious while going through this run okay now with that said let's take a quick look at the team we got the double transforming vegetas as leaders um super saiyan cumber super saiyan 4 broly Int LR Vegito, STR LR Vegito, and finally EZA Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta. So let's jump in here and hopefully get the Broly and Cumber together. Ooh! Yo, we actually did. This almost never happens. Usually when I'm trying to showcase a unit, it's always like in the second or third rotation. And I almost never get like the best linking partners together too. So that's awesome. That worked out really, really well. Uh, unfortunately, if I want to keep Cumber and Broly together, I'm going to have to put Cumber over here, which um, is not ideal, that's for sure. It's definitely not ideal. Cumber is not a bad defender, but like, look at that, yeah, 92,336 defense. Um, I'm going to have to pop an item. Let's go with a Whis immediately, just so we don't die first turn. I remember these kids hit super hard, like stupid hard. So uh, hopefully that Whis is enough. All right, here we go. So we're gonna go for Goten first, I think. And we can get a super off with Broly too, that's nice. And I guess we'll go back to Trunks with the Vegito. All right, all right, please don't super me like a million times. All right, if you're gonna super me, just one time is good. Just one super I can take. Double supers, I'm not so sure. Now, one thing that I also wanna, you know, get out there in this video oh that's not bad okay um it's the fact that broly is actually not a bad defender now i've said this a lot but i don't think people believe me broly's actually not a bad defender as long as he supers first because he only gets that additional um defense on his passive if he supers first right so before he supers if you put him in the first slot and you let him take attacks you know, before he gets a chance to get that defense, then of course he's gonna take a bajillion damage. Like it's it's really sad actually how hard he gets hit. But as long as he supers first, put him in the second slot or third slot, he's okay. Okay, so that's something that I wanna make sure people are just aware of after watching this video. And I actually missed how much he took there, but it, it probably wasn't probably wasn't too bad. Probably wasn't too bad. Okay, so now we're gonna go for Ooh, we can't super actually. Uh, let me think. Let me think. I think it should be okay. We might get an additional or something like that. If not, then at the very least he can tank. So yeah, I'll leave. Um, I'll leave Super Saiyan three go uh, Vegeta there. We'll give a Super Two Vegeta. We might be able to kill Goten there. And um, yeah, th these orbs. These orbs are not the best. But we can make two. Additional, we did get the additional. We did get the additional, but not a super. Yo, I bet, I bet what it is, is that Vegeta is holding back. Like he was thinking about doing an additional super attack for us. And then he was like, yo, hold up. That's my son, man. That's my son right there. So he's like, nah, never mind. I'm not gonna super him. She just becomes so soft, man. This man's become so soft in his, uh. <laughs> In his older age okay here we go so now we have no more uh we's active right um let me think about this should i risk it is the question i did say i was going to be a little bit conservative but at the same time i don't want to be too conservative so we got super last turn we probably won't get super again this turn right famous last words it's it's, it's probably not going to happen again right okay so I'm not gonna item this turn. We're gonna see what happens. Um, we might actually stun Goten or Trunks. Oh, okay, we killed Goten, perfect. 
Oh, wow. That took a lot of damage, though. Ouch. Well, hopefully we kill Trunks here. <laughs> please? Please, Trunks? Please just die? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, he's stunned! I think he was stunned. I think he was stunned. That's perfect. So I'm going to pop this active skill. Just so we don't have to use an item. We can just heal up for free. And we should get through the first, first stage here with not many issues, basically just one item used. I'm trying to be still like kind of uh, conservative with my items, so if, if we can use only like two or three items to get through this, that would be ideal. Although I feel like the later stages will be a little bit more difficult. Um, this, this, this event overall, like this stage overall, I, I think is the hardest category super battle stage on Global right now. You guys can correct me if I'm wrong, but I feel free. But um, I remember it gave me more trouble than Realm of Gods, than movie heroes and all that, movie bosses, all that stuff. Like, I just remember it was like a pain in the ass and like, it took me quite a few tries to beat it. So, um, I don't feel bad about using items. And Broly and Cumber are actually performing pretty well. I'm pretty sure Cumber uh, stunned the Trunks last turn. That's why he didn't attack us later. Um, like, didn't attack Vegeta after. I think that's what happened. I missed it, but it's probably the case. Okay, uh, we're gonna use a Princess Snake here. Obviously, Cumber always has to be in the first slot, um, since Broly needs to super first uh, before he gets his defense, so he's permanently in the second slot. Let me see. Uh, what's the best way to conserve orbs? Probably these, right? Yeah, probably. Yeah, let's go for Gohan. I, I believe I believe he hits harder than Gotenks. I could be wrong. It's been a while. But uh, let's just go for Gohan first. Getting supered. Thank you. Oh my god. This RNG is not with us today. The RNG is not with us today. At the very least, we lowered his attack and defense. So, took the digits there. Broly, 2.2 mil. So we're looking around like 2.2, 2.4 on average. There's a second super. Hopefully a third on the way as well. He does have that capability. Not there. Look at that though. Okay, look at that. Yo, double digits. Double digits. I know we got the active the item active, but still, that's that's quite good for category super battle and for, for this stage specifically too. Good job, Broly. Good job. I think I think our point is being made. I th I think our case. For Broly being better than most people thought on defense, like I think I think most people know that Broly is like a offensive monster, right? Especially on crossover. Like here, he's not as um, you know impressive as he could be because uh, you know he doesn't have like the Vegito support. He doesn't have um, all his links activated. And he also has a worse leader skill than Crossover 2. Crossover is 170%. Pure Saiyans right now, Vest is 150, right? So there's all those factors. And on Crossover, he's hitting roughly 4.2 to 4.5 with two Vegitos, or a Vegito plus Toa, or a, Vegi or a Vegito plus um, Supreme Cap Time as supports. So that's what he's doing on Crossover. On Pure Saiyans, as you can see, huge, huge decrease or drop in his damage output, but he's still doing good numbers, 2.2 to 2.4 million, plus the ability to do double supers pretty often, triple supers on occasion. Um, I, I think it's still quite impressive, to be honest. Uh, do we have an item active? I don't think we do. Let's use Android 8 here. I'm gonna use an 8, or, I'm, actually, I'm actually gonna put Broly here. That's just how confident I am in his ability to tank after uh, supering. And you know what? We might just kill Gotenks here. All right, one of my favorite quotes about Super Saiyan 4 Broly is um, what this guy said about the fact that, um, you know, even though he doesn't tank the best, it doesn't matter if the opponent's dead. Right, the opponent can't hit you if they're dead. So Gotenks is dead, there we go. And now we're moving on to the final stage. Uh, let me change this song real quick. I'm not a huge fan of this Tech Frieza theme. Uh, Super Battle Road. Gogeta, ooh, okay, let me turn this up a bit. There we go. All right, we got the blue Gogeta theme for the anniversary, one of my favorite themes in the entire game. So this should be good. This final stage should be good. 
Maybe I should shut up before I keep talking, because we might still get screwed somehow. Uh, let me think. So a lot of attacks at the end, a lot of attacks at the beginning. Um, I think we might have to split up these Vegitos. It's unfortunate, but just for the sake of preservation, right? Um, let's use a Icarus. And uh, we'll go after... Let's go after... Hmm. We'll go after Goku Jr. Okay. Uh, that's a super. And that is probably as much key as he's going to get this turn. Okay, there we go. And, and we get to save the token attack for next turn. Potentially. I'm not really sure if actually we will get enough meter to get the token attack. But we didn't waste it this turn. So that's, that's good. Although I guess you, it wouldn't have been a waste since... You know, it's the Vegitos, they would hit pretty hard. But usually when I do a showcase for a certain unit, I want that unit to be doing the token attack, right? So we're gonna try our best to give Broly the token attack. If it doesn't work out though, it doesn't work out. But uh, at least we, we tried and that's all that matters. We gave our best effort. Oh, by the way, yo, for anybody that missed my last video <laughs> with the all Vegito team, first of all, make sure to go check it out. Link in my, above my head, something like that. But uh, yeah, if you guys missed it, yo, I want to quickly show you guys my shirt. The homie Joseph on my chest. Kind of sus. Pause. Take that back. Joseph from, from JoJo. <laughs> yo, I love this shirt, man. It's got the oh my god on the side. It got a bunch of Japanese writing, which I'm not really familiar with, but I'm sure it says oh my god or something like that. And uh, just this shocked face, man. I just I love this character. Like even though I just finished Stardust, I still have a lot more Jojo to watch. Um, Joseph has already become like one of my favorite characters in just anime, period. Like he's just, I think he's so awesome. Like he, I think he's so funny. That's the main thing, right? Like he's kind of weak now. They kind of nerfed him in uh, Stardust compared to um, Battle Tendency, but still, he's just a great character, man. So uh, yeah, there you go. That's that's a shirt if anybody cares. And. Uh, do we, do we still have the, we, we still have, I believe, Icarus active, right? So that's probably not going to be an issue. Um, hmm, let me think. The thing is, you have a lot of int attacks. And I don't, actually no, 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 int attacks are fine. But then if we get super in the middle here, like Cumber can take those. But I think if we want to play it safe, we still should pop a Princess Snake. So now we have Princess Snake and Icarus. Shouldn't be a concern anymore, right? Okay, I'll give these to him. Uh, let's give... Oh, let's go for Machida Jr. It's a lot of orbs. That's not necessary, but a. Eh, it's fine. And wow, we still saved the token attack. Okay, that was unexpected. So I guess next turn we can just give Vegito a token attack then. And that actually might kill these boys. That actually might be it. Yo, did Cumber get the stun again? Let me see. Wait, you know what? Let's focus on Broly first. Broly, additional super, third super. Come on, man. Come on, man. You gotta show people what you're all about, man. If you don't do a triple super in this event, then people are not gonna be impressed by you. I'm just saying, you're not gonna be impressed. All right, uh, let's see what we do here. I'm going to... That is that a full, no, it's not full, but it's gonna be close to a full 24 key. Oh no, it's just the 18 key super. That's oh, fine, it's good enough. And uh, let me think, let me think. Let's put, let's put this, oh, oh, never mind, never mind. I was going to swap their positions, but that's not going to give us a Dokkan attack, or a 18 key super, so I'll keep him there. Um, I have a feeling that Vegeta Jr. might still stay alive. It's a possibility, so just to avoid that chance, hopefully we can get a crit or something with a Vegeta on him, and then go with that. Yeah, wor worst comes to worst, Vegeta Jr. stays alive, and he supers us, we probably die. 
that's the worst case scenario. So not too bad, not too bad. I can live with that. If we, if we die, if we die, we die. As uh, Drago says in Rocky 4. Rocky 4? This, there's, there's a lot of Rockies, man. I watch all of them, but I get them mixed up sometimes. I think it's Rocky 4 where he said that. Get crit, crit, crit. Nope. Oh. Ooh. Okay, we didn't get a crit there. Actually, they're both alive. Oh god. Oh god. Uh oh. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made, guys. Mistakes were made. Oh no. Whoa. How did we survive? I don't understand. <laughs> I don't understand how we survived that. <laughs> like, I, I took a really unnecessary, like, stupid risk, but man, I, I I have no idea how we didn't die there. That's crazy. No, legit, like, that's that that that's crazy. All right, yo, I, I'm a, I'm going to tempt fate a little bit more. I'm going to tempt fate a little bit more and put Super Saiyan 4 Broly there. If anybody deserves to finish this showcase off, finish this runoff, it's, uh, it's Broly. Look at that 92k before he gets hit or before he supers rather he gets hit for 92k before he supers now let's see what kind of difference we see in the damage um so from 90 wow look at that from 92k to 58 to 85 109 huge massive difference it's crazy okay so vegeta jr should be dead there we go perfect and that's gonna be the run that's gonna be the run it it, it didn't um there were some twists here and there that were a little bit unexpected but at the end of the day all that really matters is that you cleared the event and in pretty decent time this might actually be a new time for me i, I like i said man i remember being being wow yeah that's a new time 15 53 17 14 was the last best record and we didn't use all the items we saved two items two damage reduction items so hey eh, eh, you know what it wasn't the perfect run but could have been a lot worse. So there you go, guys. Um, the answer to our question in the beginning, right? Broly and Cumber, how good are they in Super Battle Road? Um, I think Broly can do okay. I think Broly can do okay. His damage output is still fine on Super Battle Road or uh, for Pure Saiyans. Obviously, it's much better for crossover, but you can't really do a full crossover team on Super Battle Road. Um, I mean, I guess you could with like all super types, with like the different, uh, all five types as well, into like a super only run, but I'm not sure how good that would be. You might have to be, you might have to use quite a few items too, but it could probably work, yeah. Um, so we can give that a shot later maybe, but um, as far as pure Saiyans goes with him and Cumber, not bad, man. I think Cumber obviously does well because uh, he has that ability to stun super types that attack him. And he also has the uh, ability to transform into Great Ape, which we didn't see today, but um, that saved me quite a few times as well. When you know, you're know you close to death and he transforms for two turns, and you can get two free turns without taking any damage. And then uh, Broly himself doing good damage, a lot of supers, uh, up to three. For some reason, he decided to not do that today, but trust me, he can do three supers. <laughs> and... Uh, I'll just say it one more time. I'm, I'm sure you guys are tired of me saying it. His defense is better than you might think. Or you might have originally thought before you had a chance to use him or see him in action. Okay, so uh, yeah, Super Saiyan 4 Broly, man. Great unit. I love him. I love all these new monkeys in the game, man. They're all fantastic. I can't wait for Bardock and Gohan to get their awakenings. But right now, I'm enjoying all of them. Like, this is literally my favorite team in the game right now. Like, this one right here. This crossover team with the two supports. And then all four monkeys, literally my favorite team to run. I use it for everything, and I don't see that changing for at least a while. Anyways, guys, that is today's video. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button. To join the Tiger Squad now, and while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.